we're here at the Evergreen Wedding Venue with Shelby and Katie. This is Shelby. Hi, I'm Shelby Renee with Shelby Renee XOXO. And I'm Katie Horton with Primps and Bows. And so the two of you do makeup and hair, and they did our model here, Nicole. And they do have their separate businesses, but they love working together and they work really well together. Um, so yeah, so tell us a little bit about what sets you apart as a makeup artist, Shelby? Um, I think what sets me apart from other makeup artists is I really like to um, hold on to like that personal connection between the bride or the client. Um, the communication up until the point of the wedding I think is very, very important in making them feel um, like they are important because in the end it is their day. And what about you, Katie? Um, for me, I think that making sure that the bride is also very comfortable um, and making sure that she has a good experience throughout our whole interaction makes for a little bit more of a relaxing day for your bride. That's true. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we want her to be very stress-free. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so Katie, if you had a dream scenario client's wedding, what would it be? Um, I really enjoy getting to work with brides who like more of a textured style, something a little bit more boho and airy, um, because I feel like that way you get to see the texture and you don't have the smooth polished look that, you know, may get blown in the wind or something like that. I think that it really holds throughout the day a little bit better. Yeah, and in the Northwest we have really intense weather sometimes, depending where your wedding is, so that's pretty important. And Shelby, what about you? That's a tricky question because there's so many fun things that you could do with a wedding, but I think my dream scenario would probably be a huge castle and like a huge ball gown and just make her feel really like soft glam like she's a princess. Nice. I think that would be really fun. <laughs> I could take that. <laughs> <laughs> so Shelby, if there was one tip that you wish you could give every single bride in the whole world, what would it be? Honestly, I think the best tip is just to relax because, you know, at the end of the day, it is your day and it is a very special day, but I think if you stress yourself out, you're going to make the experience a little bit less fun and, you know, less romantic than what it could be. So I think just taking a breather, sip your mimosa, and relax for the day. And just roll with the punches. Yes. Because there are certain things that you can't control, like it's weather. So. There's, always, there's always one thing that happens, at least one thing that happens. Yeah. And what about you? You know, to piggyback off of what Shelby said, um, at the end of the day, you're getting married. At the end of the day, you will be a couple. And so breathe, relax, take everything with a grain of salt. And like she said, sip your mimosa. <laughs> <laughs> and what if there was one tip you could give every bride about hair specifically, like you wish they all knew? thought about? Um, have realistic expectations I think is a big thing. Make sure that you know yes you can find ideas, pictures of ideas, we love seeing that, uh, but just make sure that you realize that not every head of hair is the same, you may not have the same head of hair that the person in the photo has. So realistic expectations and know that your hairstylist is going to work hard to get you exactly what you want for your big day. Um, I think when finding a photo, because typically people come to us with, um, you know, inspiration on Pinterest or whatnot, I think taking into consideration what you wear on a norm normal basis, because a lot of people want this extreme full glam, but they don't wear makeup on a daily basis, so after I doll them up, they're like, that's not me. And so you have to find a good, happy medium of what they like to wear and, you know, to doll them up on the big day as well. It seems like that's something they should try in advance too. Mm -hmm. Yes, like, exactly. A trial. Oh, 100%. Yes. I always, always tell my brides to have a trial booked. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Be sure to check out our website at northwestweddingunderground.com to see the full episode of today's feature of the Evergreens, as well as a bunch of our other favorite vendors. And follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Yay.